All right, so I heard something here from a guy on, on YouTube by the name of Mark the Messenger. And I want to play what he said, and let's come back and talk about it. 30s and 40s, now they're going to church. Now they want this type of man. Demonic patterns, guys. Eve has a soul tie with Satan. Okay, Eve had intercourse with a fallen angel in the garden, which is right. A lot of women you see today, guys, are in their fallen nature. Now, he says that Eve has a soul tie with Satan and that she had intercourse with the fallen angel in the garden. Now, I want to talk about that because I want to go to the scripture to see because I don't know where that information comes from. But if this brother happened to see this video, I would love to know the source of where you got that from. Because when I go to find out what happened in the garden in the book of Genesis chapter 1 through 3, I never read that. And But what I do want to say is that we could see from scripture that the serpent starts, the Bible started talking about the serpent in chapter 3. So let's kind of read chapter 3 real fast and let's see if it talks about... Um, Eve getting a soul tie with the devil in uh, Eve having sex or intercourse with a fallen angel in the garden. Now it says in Genesis 3 verse 1, Now the serpent was more subtle than any beast of the field which the Lord God had made. And he said unto the woman, Yea, had God said, Ye shall not eat of every tree of the garden? And the woman said unto the serpent, we may eat of the tree of the fruit of the trees of the garden, but of the fruit of the tree which is in the midst of the garden, God had said, Ye shall not eat of it, neither shall ye touch it, lest ye die. And the serpent said unto the woman, Ye shall not surely die, for God do know that in the day ye eat thereof, then your eyes shall be opened, and ye shall be as gods, knowing good and evil. And when the woman saw that the tree was good for food and that it was pleasant to the eyes and the tree to be desired to make one wise, she took of the fruit thereof and did eat and gave also unto her husband with her and he did eat. And the eyes of them both were open and they knew that they were naked and they sold fig trees together and made themselves aprons. And they heard the voice of the Lord God walking in the garden and in the cool of the day. And Adam and his wife hid themselves from the presence of the Lord God among the trees of the garden. And the Lord God called unto Adam and said unto him, Where art thou? And he said, I heard thy voice in the garden, and I was afraid because I was naked, and I hid myself. And he said, Who told thee that thou wast naked? Hast thou eaten of the tree whereof I commanded thee that thou shouldest not eat? And the man said, The woman whom thou gavest to be with me, she gave me of the tree, and I did eat. And the Lord God said unto the woman, What is this that thou hast done? And the woman said, The serpent beguiled me, and I did eat. And the Lord God said unto the serpent, Because thou hast done this, Thou art cursed above all cattle, and upon every beast of the field, upon thy belly shall thou go, and dust shall thou eat all the days of thy life. And I will put enmity between thee and the woman, and between thy seed and her seed, it shall bruise thy heel, Head. and thou shalt bruise his heel. And then God, he goes, well, God, he talks to the woman, and then he goes to Adam. He says that Eve had intercourse with a fallen angel. However, that cannot be found written in the Holy Bible. So what I want to know is, where did that come from? But I want to know where did that come from? Because I just read the interaction with Eve in the garden. And the scriptures just don't say what he said. Now, I want to go towards the end of chapter 3, what happened um, pretty much at the end uh, before God put them out the garden. And in verse 30, uh, 22, it says, And the Lord God said, Behold, the man has become as one of us to know good and evil. And now, lest he put forth his hand and take also of the tree of life and eat and live forever. Therefore, the Lord God sent him forth from the garden of Eden to till the ground from whence he was taken. And so um, so he drove out the man, and he placed at the east of the Garden of Eden cherubims, and a flaming sword which turned 
a way, was turned every way to keep the way of the tree of life. So man was driven out of the garden. God placed a share of them there with a sword, with a flaming sword, to keep them from being able to get to the tree of life. But they was men was driven out, or he was driven out the garden. So when did this take place where Eve was able to have intercourse with a fallen angel? Because the book of Genesis, chapter 1, 2, and 3, just don't say that. All right, so I'm not sure where that source comes from, but if anybody that do watch this video, for the few that do watch, tell me where to find that at. And if the, the Mark guy happened to watch this video, please send a comment on where you found that at. I want to know when did Eve get a soul tie with Satan and when did Eve have intercourse with a fallen angel? 